x is a third as a root of this equation, find the other roots of this equation, give your answers in an exact form. So given as x equals a third, if we multiply both sides by 3, we're left with 3x equals 1, and subtracting 1 from both sides results in 3x minus 1 equals 0. So we can see that 3x minus 1 is a factor of the left hand side of our equation. So I'm going to divide the left hand side of our equation by 3x minus 1. So 3x minus 1 into 3x cubed minus 7x squared minus x plus 1. And so 3x cubed divided by 3x gives us x squared, and x squared multiplied by 3x minus 1 gives us 3x cubed minus x squared and after subtracting these two rows we're left with minus 6x squared and we're going to bring the negative x down so that's minus x and then minus 6x squared divided by 3x gives us minus 2x and minus 2x multiplied by 3x minus 1 gives us minus 6x squared plus 2x and after subtracting these two expressions we're left with minus 3x so we'll bring the positive one down so minus 3x plus 1 and minus 3x divided by 3x gives us negative negative 1 and negative 1 multiplied by 3x minus 1 gives us minus 3x plus 1 and when you subtract these two that gives you 0 so we definitely know that 3x minus 1 is a factor of the left hand side therefore the left hand side can be written as 3x minus 1 multiplied by x squared minus 2x minus 1 and that equals 0 we can set x squared minus 2x minus 1 equal to 0 and so by completing the square we have x minus 1 or squared minus 1 minus minus 1 equals 0 and so x minus 1 all squared equals 2 so x minus 1 equals plus or minus root 2 therefore x equals 1 plus or minus root 2 so your final answers are 1 plus root 2 and 1 minus root 2.